I went to see Smile, and I didn't know you were in it, Kyle. Hmm. And I wrote this down because I, anyone who listens to this podcast knows I'm a big horror nut. Yeah, just they know it. And I'm always upset because, Ryan, you know, there's just not many good ones like I just said it. But this movie was not only scared me at times, but what a lot of horror movies don't do is they establish sort of a character mm. and a relationship. Mm -hmm. And by the time the movie's 10 minutes in, you don't give a shit usually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I cared about you. <laughs> and then I, 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 I began to slowly care about you as because because <laughs> you don't come in till, I mean, you kind of like yeah, yeah, come yeah, in yeah. and then you're yeah. like, oh, oh, shit, I won't give anything away. <laughs> you can give it away, now it's out, spoil No, away. no, people have to go see this especially if you like horror movies, yeah. this worked. This is one of the few out there. Yeah. So why did you like it? Like, what? Like, uh, did it scare you? It just, I, I always want to know what people feel. You know, it makes your skin crawl at times. You know that Got scene it. where you're in the room and then all of a sudden the girl's just standing there smiling at right, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, you know, you kind of like, oh my God, what's, what's happening? And right. what she does next is pretty, it's just like the right. build. Like there's a build. There's not just a sound that makes you go, oh, yeah, I'm yeah, a, yeah. a jump scare. It was... It was sort of refreshing. Got it. And you, you went through a lot yeah. with your character. I mean, that those are, movies are not easy to do or pull off. And you got to pull off that you're not crazy, but you're crazy. Right. But you're not crazy. Totally. It's so hard. I think it's probably one of like, well, Kyle, do you think, I probably think that playing anxiety, even though I'm always anxious Me too. in life, is probably one of the hardest, and I've always felt that way, like it's one of the hardest acting that, things because it's yeah. like I don't know why I can be sad or happy or whatever but anxious is hard so that so yeah it's tough it's tough do you, <laughs> do you guys I'll ask you know do you trust does it take you time to trust the director because when you're being so vulnerable you're mm -hmm. like do I look like an idiot doing this is this real is this or do you just let go and they've learned to just say hey I'm gonna do my part and he'll tell me if it's bad well I think Kyle, the thing that I loved about Kyle, like right off the bat, which clearly as like when you watch the movie, there's such a connection between us. There's such a chemistry yes. and energy, like a real, like we're playing ball. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We have like a super, you know, whatever. Um, and by the way, everyone, chemistry, if you don't get like, it's not like you need, chem like you, it's not like chemistry off screen. I mean, we're, we're friends, but I'm saying like, what, if one person is a good actor and the other person's not, it won't look like there's chemistry. Right. If, you know, if as long as both people are good actors, it will. You know or what I mean? Or they're committed, really committed. Yes, exactly. And like, and also we like really got along like as friends. But anyways, so I think what I loved about Kyle is that I can tell he's the type of actor. I can tell that he is the type of actor who has been working um, long enough to under, to know how to make stuff. And this has nothing to do with smile, but stuff that isn't written well or difficult directors and still kill it. Yeah. Not that Parker was difficult, not that it wasn't written well, just that those types of actors are the ones that can do anything. You know yeah. what I mean? So I came in, and so did Kyle, I think, as I call it, director proof, as in no matter what the director's doing, you can do your job. And I think that it took me a little while to lighten, let up on that a little bit. Right. And then once I did, I understood, like, Parker had such a vision and was so specific and was amazing. It's just that I think I was a bit, um, I'm just, I I don't trust any directors at first. <laughs> Maybe you don't trust well, people at first. Well, definitely Well, not. I also, 